This is Rostro Castanato interviewing Mimi Gibson at Dark Delicacies in Burbank, Los Angeles, California on September 24th, 2022. So now, did you get to meet Walt Disney through working on 101 Dalmatians? And if so, what was he like? I never met Walt Disney. Oh, I see. <laughs> I, um, but the interesting thing about 101 Dalmatians is there were five of us kids and we were all hired to do all of the voices. Oh, so they would take you and into the sound stage and you would do all the voices for all the puppies. So nobody knew who they were, what puppy they were. Oh, I see. And years later, I found out I was lucky. And that was very fun for me because I, lucky is lucky. Yeah. So <laughs> that was great. Nice, nice, cool, very nice. How did you get cast in the second film remake version of The Ten Commandments? Oh my gosh. Well, I was sent out on an interview and Cecil B. DeMille liked me. And don't ask me why. I, you know, he was, you know, it was a cast of thousands. And so he knew me, he'd call me by name. I was a little girl, I was probably six. And he knew me. And um, we did the parting of the Red Sea. And the joke on the set was that Charlton Heston took a step down to play Moses. Because he thought he was God. Ah, see. Oh. Yeah. All right. Very nice. And out of all the characters in film and television that you've played, which one is your favorite? Oh my gosh, I guess Elizabeth in Houseboat. I liked playing her. I had two brothers in it. Um, Charles Herbert played my younger brother. And I'd done movies with him before, so we knew each other well. And then Paul and I had done um, a print ad for TWA when I was like three and he was five. Ah. So they were both kids that I knew, and uh, Cary Grant and Sophia Lauren were wonderful, especially Sophia. Sophia was fun and funny and lovely, and I can't say enough about her. All right, very nice. Well, thank you for allowing me to interview you. Thank you. Ah, my pleasure. <laughs>